Hello, welcome back. With the revelation that I can now get a water block for my video card from EK, I now have to replan what I was going to do with the build. So, I could do it one of two ways. I could, let's see how this will fit actually. Jesus, this is tight. That's what she said. Okay. Now, I won't be able to get two of these in the front. Because there won't be enough room to stack them. And it's no use putting them side by side. That just will not fit. So, with the sides on, how much gap is there for airflow for the sides? But I only have one side. So, what I will probably need to do, and I wasn't planning on doing this in the first place, because of the heat coming off the, um, the video card is to use these. And have have them set out so that the radiators are now at the top instead of the front. Which is fine. I have no problems with that. It's just that the radiators will then be under here. And they do fit. There are screw holes for that. Now, what I could tr possibly do, maybe, is no see that's too long it's too it's too long to have both of them have just one big one in the middle or is it will that fit no that won't fit either because the back of the okay so i will need to what i will probably end up doing just mount them as in the middle as possible so that the fans are located centrally just like that and I might do it so that the in, in and out are at the back like that And then I can put the fans that we're going to go on the top, I can put them in the front so they can draw it in, draw in the air, and then because everything's going to be cooled by the, the water, anything coming up through the, through the top should be dandy. Okay, so I will probably end up putting two radiators under here. Now, what I will have, what I have done, is I've ordered a XSPC um, RGB eight-way hub so that with all the RGB, RGB devices that I'm having 
like that. Four, four fans from EK, that, the water block, the motherboard block, that comes to one, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven. Seven RGB. And I only have one header on my motherboard, and that will not power seven. And I, well, I don't feel safe about powering all seven with that. So I will be getting that device and mounting it in here somewhere. So the plan is put the pump there. I have to see where I can what I can do with the hosing. Now what I might do, if I can, do what I was planning on doing before. I'll put the power supply over here. Put the hard drives over here because that'll give me room to work with the, the pump and reservoir here. And now the hosing with the, the radiators now on top and I'm getting more hosing with the, the new equipment the hosing will probably run like this so out of the pump, across the front, down the side, up into, have a 90 degree here, the, which I don't need anymore from, for the front, for the radiator here, have a 90 degree here, and then a straight bit coming up to the radiator, and that will hold that hose in place more or less, and then from the radiator down into the CP motherboard block, motherboard block up into the radiator, down into the GPU, and out and back into the pump. And so it basically keeps the middle bit free and clear. And then there'll be fans here, Four fans here, another fan at the back here, all creating lights and a, a, a display. So it should be good. Looking forward to it. But now I need to go and order my bits. Order my bits from EK. And then start putting things together. So I'll probably start with the pump. And see where I can move from to from there. Okay, thanks for watching. Come back anytime. And I'll see you next time. Cheers, bye.